We've made clear label sensors since the mid-1990s uh, when they used to use optical sensors and they had to put black eye marks like this on the label web in order to trigger the optical sensors that were on there. But those cost money. You have to have an extra printing plate and mostly you have to run it over a turn bar because you have to flip it over and print on the back side of the web. And that means the process has to run much slower. And when you run slower, now you're gonna use a machine for a day or two instead of a few hours. And so they can be pretty costly. So I was looking for someone that was buying a lot of eye marks. I had an idea, I wanted to do an experiment and go to them, give them a free clear label sensor and say, here, stop getting eye marks, just tell me how much money you saved. I was contacted by Mark at Lion Precision uh, about a machine that they had developed to, um, uh, that was a detection machine to replace the tick marks on the backing of labels, a sensor. Um, and I connected Mark with uh, the vendor that we use to apply the labels. We were trying to come up with a way to run it with our current equipment, our current setup, to um, eliminate that cost. And uh, we got hooked up with uh, Lions, and um, they uh, gave us one of their applicator or their sensors to try. They called, and they were really apprehensive about it at start. And when they started running it, they were shocked at how well everything was running and how smooth everything and quickly everything got up and running. And it works great. Um, they don't have to print on their uh, material and they don't have to print on the label backing anymore. Lots of money saved. And they saved about 7600 bucks on the first order. I saved my customer $7,500 on that one order. That's very good. <laughs> you know, this is a clear label sensor like the ones that they used at Technipack. Uh, it uses capacitance technology instead of light. So it doesn't care about contrast and color, clearer, it's just as sensitive to that as anything. It's really a measurement of thickness, and it simply detects the change in thickness when the label comes, triggers the machine and says, here's the label edge. Works great, works on clear labels, regular labels, any old labels. Um, and when you can save $8,000 by buying one of these, it seems like a no-brainer to me. Yeah, it was a complete success. Now they're saving $15,000 a year, and they're talking about maybe ramping up production on that particular product. I'm able to get more things in that need clear labels on them. This could be saving them fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty thousand dollars $30,000 a year. I wonder about the companies out there that are still using iMarks that use a lot more than these people do. How much money are they spending on that without even needing to?